Kogas has built a smart meter app based on Service to Media's Energy Insight solution and Net2 Grid. The app gives residents of homes with a smart meter real-time insight into their gas and electricity consumption. Customers can also compare their energy usage with that of a similar household. The first time you open it, you will have to fill in your details. After the smart meter is installed, a consumer can order a smart bridge. The consumer then connects the smart bridge to the internet and then they will be provided with a login and a password. After login, you get a welcome screen. First, you have to select what kind of house you live in. You can choose, for example, apartment or a single house. After that, you have to select how many people are living in the house. They need that information in order to make a guess about your likely energy usage. Then you select a start date so that the app can be in sync with your normal energy billing cycle. Now you have to set the prices for electricity per kilowatt hour and gas in cubic meters. After that, you have to make a guess at your total usage of electricity and gas for the year. This is called your target consumption. The app offers you an estimate for this, but if you know that you are a large user of energy, you have the opportunity to override that estimate. Finally, you have some terms and conditions that you have to accept. Now let's see what insights the app offers you. You will immediately see the meter on the screen. This is your real-time energy meter and it will show you in real time how much energy you are actually using inside your house now. So the usage is currently 390 watts. Let's turn on some heavy, heavy uh, energy user like a water boiler and see what happens. The meter automatically jumps to 2520 watts. Below the meter you can see how much electricity and gas you used this year and how much you have left against your expected use. Below this you also see usage. If you press that you dive even more deeply into electricity and gas usage by seeing what you use on a monthly, weekly and daily basis. It also automatically compares your usage with a similar household. If you want to, you can also see your usage graphically and really get into the detail. And again, monthly, weekly or daily. You can see when you used too much and what you did in previous years and what similar households are doing in a detailed graph. On the bottom, you can also find notifications. These are push notes that will tell you specific details about the Kogas app. They can also be used as notifications for Kogas so they can tell you when there's things like maintenance or construction going on in your area. There's also a tip screen. Here you can find smart tips, for example, an article about replacing your normal lamps with energy saving lamps. And if you press the arrow on the top right hand corner, you'll see the next article. I mean, with this case, it's about fireplaces. On the bottom right, you can find the settings. Here you can see my meters and have all the information on what kind of meters you are currently using. The rest of the settings are similar to those that you filled in when you started up the app at the beginning and are editable at any time. Finally, there's a section about the app where you'll find an explanation of what it can do and how it all works. Being efficient in our use of energy has become increasingly important. The Kogas app is a fun way to get the insight that lets you monitor and plan your energy usage. It's also a great example of how to use a predefined solution from service to media to bring a sophisticated multi-platform app to market extremely quickly.